On September 15th, police released Crown Plaza hotel footage of Kanika Jenkins apparently staggering through the hotel hallways, stumbling into a stairwell, and lastly, wandering into the hotel's kitchen. The video clips released do not show Jenkins entering the walk-in freezer where her body was found. However, the security video appears to be captured by a motion activated camera, which did not display anyone coming into the area until her body was found. Andrew Holmes, a longtime Chicago anti-violence activist, told the Tribune that local detectives allowed him to review the hotel footage from the Crown Plaza Wednesday. The video shows what the police originally reported. Jenkins walked herself into the hotel's freezer, according to Holmes. The important part is we all wanted to know, did anyone call her down there? He said, did anybody force her down there? Was there anybody on the other side of the room when she got down there? And the answer to that is no. According to a spokesperson for the Crown Plaza Hotel, there is no footage available for Kanika. There is no footage available of Kanika Jenkins walking into the hotel freezer. The Rosemont, Illinois Hotel does not have a video camera trained on the freezer where Jenkins' body was found. The station reported, the video clips released show Jenkins roaming around the hotel for more than an hour. The family has not been provided any video or other evidence of Kanika Jenkins walking into a freezer, Larry Rogers Jr. said in a statement. Serious questions remain as to how she ended up in a crown Plaza Hotel Freezer and why it took a day and a half for the hotel to find Kanika.